Hello, my name is Shira Benson. I'm a member of First Centennial Missionary Baptist Church. I have one daughter and two wonderful grandsons, age 10 and 15, that I love so dearly. Women history means to me that um, all the women that came before me who um, strived, made this world a better place, um, set boundaries, put things in place for the future, which would be me, and the future behind me. Um, um, making history. I'm gonna have to say my grandmother that lived to 104 because of the way she eat, the way she carried herself, put God first for everything. My mom for raising four children. Um, she was married but was divorced. Um, she always instilled in us, do your best the first time because you might not be getting a second chance. Um, keep your head up when you're doing stuff. Um, and always be confident in your walk. I mean, so many things. That, Oh boy, um, just remember whatever you do in life, God is always there with you to comfort you, to support you. Um, and being a single parent raising four kids, um, She always made sure home was right, that we had food to eat, education. Always made sure we went to church. Um, believed in what we done, because if you don't believe in yourself, no one else will. That's all I'm gonna say about that for now. <sighs> if you're alone, <laughs> With your independence, always make sure you can survive, no matter what's going on. Don't go in with somebody, a house, um, uh, a property, anything, whatever you do, make sure you can do it alone. Because if they back out, you go, you can't do it. You can't, you're struggling, you know, because you were depending on someone else. So always depend on yourself. If you can't do it yourself, don't do it. Don't do it. I believe um, we challenge because we always have to prove ourselves. Rather, it's our strength. Rather, it's our mind, um, our abilities to do things. Um, you know, when it comes to our counterparts and the workforce. And even in church, we still have to prove ourselves that we're fit and we belong wherever it is we're at. The workforce, um, we want to be equal. Um, we will expect the same pay as the next. Why do we have to prove that we deserve it when the next man do not? Um, uh, our abilities in school, we always have to prove this when our grades approve it, but we have to show more than the counterpart. Um, it's always a challenge. Just stepping outside, being a woman, we always the weaker vessel. In the Bible, we are the weaker vessel, but we're just strong mentally. Don't always try to be seen. Be a leader at what you're doing. Be confident in what you're doing. Um, keep God in your life, definitely. Even now, at the age I am, I still try to do things on my own, knowing, knowing God got me. And all I need to do is ask God for it, and he will fix it. He will work it out. So for my younger self, 
strive high, reach high, um, keep good company. <laughs> um, there's going to be people who's not going to like you. You can't always try to please other people. You have to please yourself. And with pleasing yourself, make sure you please God and everything will work out. For God first. I'm going to have to go back to that. Um, pray more. Stay prayed up. Um, because I can't do it alone. Um, you do need a man in your life. The Bible says you are not built and he didn't build you to be alone. So put God first and everything else will flow. <laughs>